It is the way to a woman's heart. You know, they just say it's for men. What I've got here, it's a different type of steak. But because Veronica's been so cool with me and she's going through a lot of real rough times and she helped me get through my rough times, I decided to make her a dinner tonight. Now, um, I really haven't cooked on camera since, um, well, since I made the chicken. And usually I like to do cooking because I, I love to cook. But tonight is a very special occasion. I want to do something special for Veronica because, you know, she's moving into a new job and she's just a great, wonderful person. I can't say enough. She spoke very highly about going with me and doing, watching me do some recording of songs. So I, I, I just thought that was really nice that she put up on Facebook. But, you know, there there's... The companionship that Veronica and I have is just dynamic. And I don't think you can get anything better. You know, we don't, we laugh, but we don't need to be partying it up in order to laugh. I'm just crazy naturally. You want to meet me? Anytime. So I'm making this dinner for her, and I hope she enjoys it. And we're cooking for Veronica. See, I lost some of the dew, if you know what I mean. Oh, the medicine uh, the treatment that they were giving me for take care of one problem, maybe lose another. Anyway, as I get the plate. This is my kitchen. I got a new refrigerator, a new stove, an oven. Oh my God. And, but this is for Veronica. Just to say I love you, Veronica. Thank you for putting up my bullshit. Uh, back and forth to the doctors and hospital and everywhere else I've had to go. So this is special for her and I hope you enjoy it, Veronica. Uh, this is, a, like, I was going to do a music video, but you know, I, I, I've thought about it. I've been working on music so much and it's like, I'll let you guys be the judge. If you think I should just stop all together, then I'll stop. You know, whoa, whoa. I guess that's too hot. Hey, look at that. There's so much mess up. Holy shit! There's a fight going on. Oh, it's alive! Well, you don't have to get pissed off about it. Mashed potatoes just flopped all over the place. This is terrible. Look at the mess. Look at the mess. That's alright. I'm doing this for Veronica. Maybe she'll clean it up for me. We will turn you this way now. Go we'll look at the mess. That was made by this bullet. Guess that's why they call it spuds, huh? I made a mess all over my brand new. Me too. Well, Veronica, as you did. I tried. Well, we did get the spuds in order. It's all good now. And as I was saying before, as I was so rudely interrupted by the spuds, now I leave it up to you. I mean, I'm kind of getting old. This month is my birthday. And I'm not even going to say how old I am, but I'm up there. I'm a lot older than what a lot of you people are. And uh, believe it or not, we'll be, I, I didn't want to say my age, but I'm going to be 60 years old. And maybe it's time for me to just retire from the old thing. I'm an old man! But Mr. Winky still works. Anyway, I'm joking around. And I'm trying not to... I'm making this, it, it, this is a different type of steak, I forget what kind of steak they, and, and I should have read it, i put it in there, but I've always been a good cook, and I will say I'm always a good cook because I had so many people uh, comment on it, wow, there you really are a good cook. I don't do a lot of cooking, uh, my kids are all growing up now, and I'm not married no more, <laughs> that's a blessing. Well, nothing against him, but it's just things don't work out. But I used to love to cook for my kids. I'm doing this for Veronica because also, if you didn't know, she finally got her divorce, divorce papers last week. And so I guess I'm kind of celebrating everything for her. And uh, so this way she could know that somebody really does appreciate her because a lot of people don't seem to appreciate Veronica. 
and the good things that she does do for people at her job, wherever she goes, it's just dynamic, you know. I'm only six years older than Veronica. I'm not going to be 60. I just mess with it. Getting close to it, though. But uh, I figure I'd take a few minutes as I'm cooking because I like, can't wait to see her face. You know, I was trying to surprise her. And uh, it was a hot day up here. But this is my place. This is uh, obviously, I think, people know that I don't live with Veronica anymore. We're living together as roommates in the house. And I'm not one that, I'm real touchy, I like things clean, I know it doesn't look this way back here, but I'm real picky about it. So, that's why I live by myself. I'm a real, when I do work on music, I'm, I'm not home that much anyway, I'm always running out. If you guys think I should give up the music thing, please let me know, because really, maybe I'm just too old for it. I just do it for an enjoyment for myself. It's great for your mind, it keeps your mind, and I'm always positive. And, you know, I, I've thought about just, you know, quitting YouTube uh, after I get 700 videos. You know, people don't want to see the same thing, this the same music, and I can respect that. I always try to do something different, and that's what I was doing the other night. I was playing around, where I was getting a good laugh out of it. You know, we just had a great time, and she could take the time to spend with me, because I really don't see her that much. I mean, there's other people that would like to spend time with me, but. I, um, because of going through chemo or uh, treatment that I had to and the loss of my hair, uh, I, I just, I say to myself now, it's just like, even Veronica, I don't even see Veronica, like I said, that much, but she's coming over for dinner. We, we have a good time, we have a good relationship, the companionship is awesome. And it's not always about fucking, as a lot of people think, that you go to bed with somebody, mm -hmm, yeah, it's all about sex. It's all I've heard about on Facebook. But if you really love somebody, and as as I have that heart, love love certain people, I, you know, and I do. I really care about people. I don't want to see that happen. But this is a special dinner for Veronica because she you know you know to you people who really watch our videos, and we'll be doing a shout out tomorrow, or I will uh, for you guys. There are some people that I missed in the last shout out. So this is August. I'll be doing one each month. Um, I'm still going to be doing the butt man because I have to. Um, I've done just finished, like I said, I just finished off Ghost Town, the, the whole music CD. I had to redo uh, Where Nobody's Alone. And of course, I'm just, I, I not finished, I'm still working on it. It's called We Have the Night, which was, I wrote in 1985. It was a pretty awesome song. And there were some great tunes on this one. And I, I'm only doing it, I do it out of fun. I mean, like I said, I don't have to put music videos up, I, I, but there are people that really watch my videos and get into them. I do it for you guys. I, I do it for fun. I mean, the vlog of the week, I'll probably never leave because I love what I go out and do different things and I have a good time. And of course, the hauntings, I never will stop. I wish I could do more. There's so many different videos I do, but like I said, I'm getting a little older. And I mean, I'm hitting a big number this year. I'm trying to get 700 videos up. And I'll be putting some old videos up, actually. I'll put, be putting from the uh, 92, I think, and 91. Or 91 and 1990, I think they are. And there was like a whole uh, set that we did where I did all these Elvis songs. and. Back then, it was called Sing Along Machine. I got the very first one that ever actually came out. A lot of people don't know this. I went to Memphis, and uh, I had done a show down in Memphis, and they had this big, big, huge thing, and it was called the Sing Along Machine. And it was very one of the first ones that came out. It wasn't the things you see today. And went into the studio and started doing some recording of Elvis songs, and. Then all of a sudden they said, hey, get some people, videotape it when you go back home. I got this, this team in and they came in and they videotaped me while I'm singing to my ex-wife in sign language. And so I'll be putting stuff like that up. I'm sorry, I bored the hell out of you. But let's see how Veronica's reaction is.